Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to 10 Years On and today we're looking at Phil Foden. Before we get started, of course, make sure you like, subscribe and all that good stuff to the channel to get more stuff like this. And of course, leave any comments below of any players you want to see in 10 Years On. But let's jump into it. Phil Foden. I mean, I'm sure you're all fully aware of who Phil Foden is. He's a fantastic player for Manchester City, 21 years old, already made nine caps and scored two goals for England, being paid £100,000 a week and valued at £59 to £178 million. To be quite honest, you're probably unlikely to be able to sign him, and it would surprise me if he even leaves Man City in the next 10 years. But we'll see. We'll certainly have to see how that works. But you can see just by his uh, stats there, it's kind of ridiculous. Some good physicals, technicals are amazing, and his mentals are absolutely brilliant with the off-the-ball vision work rate, all composure as well. At, at 21, you've got years to go. He is injured, so I don't know if that will stunt his growth a little bit. He's out for six to, six weeks to two months at the start of the game, uh, scoring 15 goals in 69 appearances already. But let's jump 10 years on and take a look at how he gets on. So as expected, he's not leaving. He's been at Manchester City this whole time. 31 years old now. He's not for sale. And I mean, look at the greens all in there. Absolutely fantastic stuff. Some great passing technique. Free kick takings also upped as well. Mentals looking brilliant as ever. And his physical is still looking pretty fine. 7.37 um, average rating. Not too shabby. 114 caps and 23 goals for England as well. So he's hit the century. Uh, can play anywhere behind the striker and in centre midfield. Uh, quite an incredible player, to be quite honest. Uh, look at those average ratings as well. I mean, it's kind of ridiculous at how good he is. Man City have quite the player there coming through their academy. Milestones-wise, I'm sure we'll see a lot of trophies coming from him as he's at Man City. But let's take a look. So yeah, we can see here... Champions League runner-up, Carabao winner, Premier Division winner. They came <laughs> runner-up in the Euros, obviously. 2022 World Cup fourth place for England, Community Shield runner-up. Won the Premier League and the FA Cup, though. Um, in 2023 and 24, they were quite limited. Uh, didn't win anything in 23, won the Carabao Cup in 24. Then 25 came round and they have just won everything. Uh, Premier League, FA Cup, Champions League, Community Shield and Super Cup. I mean, that's... Very impressive. Uh, <laughs> and as it, as we go up, you can just see all the different things that they've won. Uh, European International League third place for England as well. And recently won the Carabao Cup uh, awards. I mean, there's just going to be loads, isn't there? There's He's going to be in the Manchester City 11. But we'll have to see if we can find anything um, that pops out to us. Uh, English players, young player of the, season, of the year. So that's impressive. Uh, is there anything else of similar ilk? Uh, named 2024 English player Premier League Team of the Year. So he's been named in the Team of the Year. It looks like a couple of times, actually. Um, Champions League Dream Team. Uh, so that's pretty good. Named in England Seasonal Best 11, of course. In the goal, 53rd place. So he got third place there. World Team of the Year as well in 2027. So very, very impressive. Runner-up of the goal, 50 in 28. But it doesn't look like, as far as I can tell, he actually ends up winning it. So that's a shame. But there you go. That is Phil Foden looking f absolute fire. Legendary attacking midfielder. I'm sure that will probably happen in real life for Man City. Certainly. I can't imagine him leaving there anytime soon. But there you go. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Make sure you like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And as always, make sure you leave a comment down below to leave any ideas for players you want to see up next. But I will catch you in the next one.